The U.S. declared a public health emergency for the outbreak of monkeypox. More than 6,600 Americans have been infected. Critics had accused the Biden administration of taking too long to react to the spread of the virus. This move allocates more resources to fight it. Fox 4's Blake Hansen spoke with local health leaders and has more. Blake. Yeah, Heather, last week the World Health Organization declared a public health emergency. The U.S. now looking to follow suit, to hopefully get more resources for, va for vaccines, while also hoping to stretch the exi existing vaccine supplies even further. A new recognition from the White House about the severity of the global monkeypox outbreak. The Biden administration declaring a public health emergency. We're taking this very seriously. We're, take, we're accelerating uh, and strengthening the, uh, and our comprehensive response. The announcement is expected to free up money and other resources to fight the virus. It can cause fever, body aches, chills, and a rash similar to chickenpox. The White House has faced criticism for not acting more aggressively. It's allocated more than 1.1 million vaccine doses, but clinics across the country report there is more demand than supply. It ordered millions more doses and expanded testing, but only after the virus has been in circulation for weeks. The initial science led us to believe that those doses would be sufficient to meet the needs of the country, as what we knew at that time, because it's dynamic, it's changing. And so, but however, infectious diseases are dynamic, as I just said, and unpredictable. There are now 209 confirmed cases of monkeypox in Dallas County. The virus is primarily spread among men who have sex with other men, though anyone can become infected. Dallas County and area clinics have been swamped with calls seeking the vaccine. You know, uh, for getting the vaccine right now, uh, you know, our phone bank, we're taking uh, sort of creating a waiting list. And as we get more slots opened up and more availability, uh, we're going down that list and trying to, uh, to get people connected with those vaccines. Federal officials also announced Thursday regulators are looking at a way to stretch supplies of the vaccine by vaccinating five people instead of one with each vial. In the meantime, health officials are doing the best they can with the resources they have. We're still, you know, getting it out there. We're working with some other community partners. Some of them are going to be coming online in the next days and, uh, you know, probably next week uh, sometimes. The uh, county initially could only give vaccine doses to someone who is directly exposed to the monkeypox virus. The vaccine will now be offered to any man who has sex with men who is 18 and older and sexually active over the last two weeks.